Hi YouTube, this is Tara. Welcome back to my channel. I know that the camera and everything is a little off, but I'm doing whatever I can to kind of prop the camera up so you all can see. Okay, so these are my nails. You see, this is my ring finger, and this nail splits all the time, like straight down the middle. You can still kind of see the split. And this is my, what they call, pointer. Okay, I don't know where my file is <laughs> i don't know where my file is i have a file in my purse but now i can't find it so this is my savvy man um i guess it's a flash cure but it goes to um let me show y'all it goes to 10 30 60 you know so I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to flash cure um, my nails um, about two, three times. Okay. And I'm going to put a very, very, very thin coat or just um, one, two, three go press on gel. Okay. A very thin coat of that. And we're gonna see how that goes. So right now we got nail prep. Okay, we got nail prep by E Nail Couture. And it's my lunch time. I should have showed y'all my nail before I applied the nail prep, but it kind of sort of turns white. I'm not expecting for this to do like um this is just an experiment. If it goes the way I hope it goes, I think it goes, then we've done good. <laughs> okay. Okay, you know. And then you got primer. Okay, we're gonna go in with a layer of primer. I don't know how many layers of primer you're supposed to go in with. Let me know down in the comments. <laughs> How many layers did you go in with a uh, primer? I don't know why I didn't let y'all see the nail for real, but y'all get the idea. Hold on, I can't see. I'm not turning around my way. Oh, let me get that off my skin. So... This primer, it smells like acrylic or a monomer. It smells like liquid monomer. This one, it smells like nail polish remover. So, I better not be spending money on monomer and nail polish remover. But the primer itself is sticky. Once it dries, it dries. You can see that shine on it. You can see that? And the nail prep, when it dries, the nail dry down real dry, ashy looking. And so when you go in with that coat of primer, it ends up giving you that little shiny finish like that so after that we're gonna put this on as like a builder gel okay let me show y'all what she what she looks like she
she's thick. Y'all, we're gonna put a thin layer of her. We're gonna put a real thin. And these bottles, let me tell you something, I like eating their couture, but they don't feel full. Some of the other brands that I have purchased, and I purchased, I don't think, this, this didn't come in a scoop. I bought this, this was like a non-scoop item. Their primers, they are like, this is probably like a, you can use it for a builder gel, or nail strengthener. strengthener. Okay. I don't know how long it take that primer to dry, but this is my left hand. And you know, I do my left hand with my right hand. My right hand, I do with my non-dominant hand, which is my left hand. And these nails are staying on pretty good, including this one right here that I fixed. This is the only one on this hand, on my right hand, that I had to fix. This is the only one. And I'm just trying to get through the week. Um, you know, especially with this one. Especially with this one right here. Because it'll split down the middle and then it'll break off. So hopefully, um, if you all have watched um, Tutorials by C on YouTube, right? She had came out with her own kit called Glazed, right? So, I ordered one in February, at the end of February, and I never did get it. And I kept contacting, DMing her on Instagram. I tried emailing the website. Then I went to the website. The whole website was shut down. I have never seen that before in my life, where if a product is sold out, you shut your whole website down. You just put a little thing up that say sold out. You know? So, my phone has a delay in it. I don't know how this going to go, y'all. This phone, my phone has a delay in it. Let me leave it alone before it cuts off. <laughs> okay, so I think that's good. Yeah, it feels dry. I don't know. They say you're not supposed to... Um, they say you're not supposed to put your primer in the lamp. I had did that one the other day. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go in with this. We're going to do like a really, really, really thin, a very thin layer. I mean, like, ain't nothing on the brush, hardly. Okay, nothing on the brush, hardly. So it's starting to roll down the brush on this side. And that's what we're going to use. Let's use, wait a minute, what's happening? We're going to use this side with hardly nothing on it. I got to do like this, so I'm sorry. So I can see what I'm doing. y'all can't really see it but I'm sure y'all this is still the same brush
and I'm just tapping right here on the tip where that nail usually breaks and then I'm gonna go up under okay this smells good This smells good. So, also, another reason why I think my nails are popping off, you guys, is because my, when I do my uh, nails, they do flood the cuticle a little bit. That's why you have to be very careful with gel products because gel products, they run. Okay, so, <laughs> let me see. Let me see, one, two, sixty. It's on sixty. Y'all yeah, can't see it, but it's on sixty. Need to turn it around so I can see. Oh, it's on 27 minutes. Y'all saw that? It's pretty. Okay. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna let y'all see this part first. Ooh, I touched it by mistake. I touched that finger by mistake. You can't tell it. Shall we touch it to see? Oh, we gotta go up under here. Sorry. <laughs> we gotta go up under here. I feel it doing something too. I think some of it had got on my skin a little bit.
y'all. You didn't get on my skin at all. Okay. Shall we touch it and see what's going on? I'm scared to touch it. Hey, y'all. Y'all can see me on both sides. This is the door that I have. I, I have my phone stuck inside the two doors. And I'll show y'all. Hey, y'all. Y'all, don't want to look like that. <laughs> okay. Like, like, so let's see. Ooh, I don't know if it's if it did anything. We gonna we gonna give it. We gonna give it another sixty seconds, and we not gonna put no um. We not gonna put no more. We not gonna put no more of this. Although we could. We, we just not going to do that because we don't want to take the risk of it not actually being cured. So we're going to do another. Another 60 seconds. Y'all, this ain't easy. I could have laid the, the flash lamp right there. But you all wouldn't be able to see the lamp. I <sighs> had indigestion. I took a Aleve, I mean, uh, uh, I took a Nexium. I haven't taken one in months. This tip trying to come off too. When, when you do your nails, make sure you get them filed and everything to your liking. Because if you start filing on them nails and stuff after you done cured it and decorated it, and you got them tips on, that's them tips gonna pop off. trying to shoot the bird or nothing. Okay, so now what we get ready to do, what we fix in the day. We're going to go ahead and take our stickers out. I don't think we need our brush. We got us a little paint polish. We got us a little builder gel. We got us a more builder gel. And then we got us a, a top coat. We got us a top coat. Now, whew, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take one of these alcohol pads. Should we take the alcohol pad and wipe it? Wipe that little sticky layer off? Let's see. Just so, just for uh, experimental purposes. Okay, let me see. 
we just gonna stick our finger down in here since we don't have it open all the way. Isn't ain't I smart? Ain't I smart, y'all? And then we're gonna take this one and do the same. Ain't I smart? I smart. I smart. I smart, girl. You smart. Uh oh. Maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> Let's close this up, keep this tight and right. So, look, you can you tell there's nothing on here? It's, it's not moving. It just look like your regular nail, right? Wait a minute. Anyway. Let's get us a sticker. Let's get us a sticker. So if we can either go in with this pink from OPI or we can put two stickers on here. Or both. These ain't soak off because they shall look like soak off. These look like soak off stickers. I ain't got time to soak off nothing. Hmm. Yeah, because it's like all one sheet. And these are some Easter stickers. And you got stars and flowers and... I don't want no Easter egg, yeah. Yeah, I need soak off stickers. Cause it got that cardboard on here. Oh, wait a minute. I might be able to get this one off. Uh -huh. I think I might be able to just pull this one off. No. Because the white paper. The white paper is coming up too. That was a good idea. But we ain't gonna waste our whole lunch break trying to soak no stickers off. Not me. So we just gonna go ahead and put the OPI and Prince's rules. Uh, I hope it's not sticky up under here. We're gonna put Prince's rule. Okay. Just to give it a little something. I've always liked this princess rule. She, I know y'all can't really see her, but she's real pretty. She's 
pink barely okay with some shimmers in it and we only gonna put one coat of her what she looked like she's light she's shimmering she kind of reminds me of wink that pop the happy gel that I use from email couture right kind of remind me of that but she has pink on her. Okay. And that's the other one. She's sheer but shimmery. And this is my real nail. This is my real nail. Just like this is my real nail, but it has the hard gel on top of it. And this is, yes, this is the one that breaks all the time. Okay, she's not quite dry. So as soon as I get my kit, my glazed kit from uh, Tutorials by C, I'll unbox it. Don't know if I'm going to actually use it. Or I might get it. And just not unbox it. Right? And just wait until I'm ready to use it. There's not a lot of people doing reviews. On her um, kit. She, she killing it. You know, she is. She's definitely... Um, promoting her own and I think she's getting ready to come out with a builder gel this light is on a timer hold on y'all let me see what oh it's 104 hold on to um you have to move around to trigger um the light so it can stay on now I don't have a whole lot of time should I go in with this top coat which takes 60 minutes to cure or should I go in with the another builder gel because the top coat is just a non white not sticky top coat but the builder gel gives you more strength to your nail and since this nail is always breaking this one I think I might need a little bit more strength on this nail then and she's about dry so we're gonna go in we hope our lamp is still hot enough I charged her before I left home. I got one contact in my eye. Okay, so I charged her before leaving home. I'm gonna go in with a thin layer. Okay, we're just gonna go in with it. Wait, let me get this side. Cause this is just a side right here that y'all can see that I usually can't see. Okay. So what 
what we're gonna do is we're just gonna get some off this wand and dip like this. Okay. Because like I keep saying, build a jail, she moves. So she spreads. One contact, so y'all see me squint, you know, squinching. I gotta call my eye doctor. This is the Melody Susie Builder Gel. Okay, I got a, a V Pure Beauty. I have a Builder Gel from them too that I'm definitely gonna try because I hear they are the bomb.com. And y'all, I messed around and put my alcohol pad back in here. Okay, so we got us an alcohol pad. Okay, so now our builder gel has kind of settled. Uh oh, I see it getting in them cuticles. I see it getting on them side walls. Uh huh. Yep. Uh huh. Yeah, you thought you were going to get me. Then you. Yeah, you did. You thought you were going to get on them sidewalls and then start lifting. That's the problem right there with me. Because they get on the sidewalls and I'm not good with the cleanup. And then they start lifting off them sidewalls. Okay, so I'm going to get her 60 seconds. And if we need to do a top coat, we'll do her on my 215 break. go 10, 20, 30, 60. This polish is pretty.
Let's see. Almost. I got three minutes. Let's see. Ooh, yep. Yeah, she's sticky. Oh, I got three minutes. Let's flash cure her again. I don't know why people do like this with their lamp because the lamp is big, big enough for one finger. So we're going to take this one because I put the other one. Okay, I'm going to stick her in here. <laughs> but I, I put the other one in the bag, in the bottom. I put her in first. Okay, I don't see nothing rubbing off. So she must be cured. Mm. Let's, see. Let's see her down in here. I got a base coat too from um Rocket Fuel. Y'all remember that company, Rocket Fuel, that was talking about they guarantee you, almost guarantee your nails were going to grow long. First of all, the base coat to me, in my personal and humble opinion, the base coat is better than the Rocket Fuel product that's supposed to grow your nails long. It's feeling a little shady, like it's not cured, but that's okay. Cause we gonna cure her again. And then we gonna add this on top of it, but not right now. Okay. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs up my video, tell a friend, tell a friend about my channel. I love you for watching to the end. Bye. Okay, I'm getting ready to do a uh, shorts. I just repaired two of my nails, the index finger and the ring finger, with these products, the E Nail Couture Primer 
the E-Nail Couture Nail Prep and the E-Nail Couture Press-On Gel. One, two, three, go. Plus, I used OPI as my nail color and as my top coat I went in with Melody Susie Build the Gel. This is my first time using her and I used this Savvy Land Flash Cure Lamp <clears throat> and I did each cure for 120 seconds. So we'll see how this goes for the rest of the day. Thanks for watching.